ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for tuning in. It is Squidgemeister here with another episode of Ark Scorched Earth. I wasn't planning on doing an episode today, but I just had to do a showcase on just the Jaboa. We've got some epic music. There you go. It's just how epic these guys are. So look at the hats they can wear. They're amazing. This guy's rocking the safari hat. Oracle rocking the safari hat for us. We've got Predictor rocking the hunter hat. And then uh, Diviner rocking the desert goggles. And I'm going to show you all the hats that they can wear. I'm pretty sure I've got... You know what? I reckon I, I don't have the kind of unique hats you can get. And I bet you they can wear a lot of the hats from the kind of mods you can get too. Now uh, let's see. i put a hide on this guy. And then uh, I, ju I just want to give you guys the full impression. You see? Alright, so those are three lower tier ones. Oddly enough, the cloth and the hide are fairly similar, but it's funny just how different a look it gives them. If you're doing an RP server, that make, might make all the difference for you. This one's more of a pirate. This one could even be a little monk. This one, definitely some kind of little warrior. Anyway, let's try and get the next row on. So if we're going now for flak. Ooh, the ghillie one's really cool. Seriously cool, guys. So you could even go for like a kind of ninja look. And I believe that's it. Uh, yep, I've done them all. I've done Flack and Gilly. So there are the Flack and the Gilly one. Look at the Gilly one. Come on, buddy. Don't be shy. There you go. <laughs> They're just amazing. Look at that. So I didn't actually think that this would work. But it does, and it looks great. It's not at all glitchy. You can probably do this with the Mesopithecus as well, but you don't get those on this map. These guys are brilliant, by the way. They, they predict the storms, and it's extremely useful. And that's it, that's the Jaboa showcase done. For my for my subs or anyone new to the channel, I just want to show you my, my new base on the, the uh, Creative Misfits server, playing on there with a bunch of guys. It's Squidge Home, we're over at the Green Obelisk, as you can see. We've got Hard Humps over here, she's rocking out. And Mouth Breather, the, uh, <laughs> the thorny dragon, called that because he just doesn't close. Actually, he always, he's only not closing his mouth because he's got that bit in his mouth. I wish I could remove that, it doesn't look very comfortable for him. Now we've got Gandalf, because <laughs> he likes to teach everyone magic. And what have we got inside the house? Nobody? No, there's no one inside the house, but I'll show you inside anyway. This is my, my setup. It's very functional, not very aesthetically pleasing. That's just kind of the builds I usually go for before I get my creative ones going. And that's it, guys. I, uh, I'll just end the video there. It's a really short one. Just to show you around, that's Lakitu's base. You can check out his videos too. We've got Drelance and Kirsten. We've got a little base set up there. The Kirsten's is up on that hill. And I believe that one, that little shack, is Cody's Gaming's base. I could be wrong. It might be Boom Bang Crash's base. I'm not sure. But there's a bunch of guys. You can find all of their details in, in the down there. And that's it. I will end my video here. I really hope you've enjoyed watching today. And if you have, please hit the like button. And consider subscribing. And hopefully I'll hear from you next time. Take it easy, guys.